The Fayette County woman's birth control nearly killed her. Yeah, amazing. But doctors and cutting-edge technology actually kept her alive. Local 24 News reporter Jalen Socek has this local health alert. Be on blood thinner six months and then hopefully. From all accounts, Haley Duncan was a healthy 18 year old when she was rushed to Baptist Memorial Hospital last week. I just thought it was the heat or something. And uh, I was actually about to go shower and then I ended up passing out and then my uh, lung collapsed in the ambulance. She went into cardiac arrest and had to be resuscitated several times. Two blood clots were discovered near her lungs, believed to be caused by her birth control pills. She was just hanging on by, you know, a thread. Duncan was too sick and weak to be operated on, nor could they give her blood thinners. Doctors opted to using this life-saving machine called ECMO, which replaces the function of a heart and lungs. It stabilized her within minutes. Cardiologist Brad Wolf said they've used ECMO nearly 100 times to save lives. We can put them on this machine and we've had some remarkable results of otherwise people who you think are going to die that have survived from this. Blood clots are a known side effect to birth control, but Wolf says her case is still unusual. It's not rare, I think, overall to have this happen with birth control. I think it can happen in, you know, one of a thousand people taking it, but usually it's people who have other risks, not people who are as healthy as her and certainly not people who are as young as her. Now recovering, the weight of what happened hasn't set in for Duncan. It hasn't hit me. Nope. I'm just over here like, I almost thought it's all good. Reporting in Memphis, Jalen Socek, Local 24 News. Now, before taking birth control, doctors advise women to actually check with your OBGYN about the side effects and what it could mean for your health.